There have been some questions with regard to the sodium content of GoFoods products. This is Steve Shank, founder of GoFoods Global. I would like to start this discussion by letting all of you know that when any of our products are formulated, careful consideration is given to each one of the ingredients we place in these recipes. We wouldn't tell you that this is the best food on the planet if we didn't have the intention of making it so. The subject of sodium is absolutely no exception. Here is our position on sodium. Unrefined sea salt is intentionally included in GoFood's recipes as a natural ingredient in quantities essential to maintain optimal health. A 2006 study published in the American Journal of Medicine found that the sodium intake of less than 2300 milligrams, the daily recommended allowance, was associated with a 28% increase of all-cause mortality. In short, people who consume too little salt are more likely to have an earlier and higher death rate. I need to point out that we have a very peculiar situation here. The ingredient and nutritional panels on most food packaging brag about the fact that they have 100% of the recommended daily allowance, RDA. However, with sodium, there has been such a brouhaha and misconceptions created about it that its RDA is seen as a maximum allowable. Think about it. The American Journal of Medicine is telling us with their study that anything less than 2,300 milligrams per day is actually dangerous. But here is a very important point. When GoFoods lists either salt or sodium on its ingredient list, it is referring to unrefined sea salt as opposed to regular table salt. This is extremely important. Please understand that most people are not aware of the fact that there is considerable difference between the processed table salt that is most commonly used and natural sea salt derived from the sea. Common table salt is 99.9% .9 sodium chloride. This is obtained from mined salt deposits, which are heat blasted at more than 1200 degrees Fahrenheit. After that, they're chemically treated. The enormous heat causes an alteration in the natural chemical structure of the salt, along with stripping it of all minerals other than the sodium chloride. This heavily processed salt can throw your body out of gear totally. It's interesting that when people started consuming this chemically treated, demineralized salt about a hundred years ago, high blood pressure and water retention that had never been linked with salt before became associated with salt intake. Now people who are concerned with nutrition and health have realized for a long time that heavy processing of food destroys its nutrition and also eliminates the body's ability to recognize it as food. So let's look at sea salt. Sea salt is unrefined salt that comes directly from the sea or ancient sea beds and retains traces of various minerals such as iodine, zinc, magnesium, potassium, calcium, manganese, and iron. Being unprocessed, sea salt has many healthy advantages. It actually reduces blood pressure, plus helps the adrenals, kidneys, and liver to work more effectively. It also has the ability to help to boost your immune system. Unrefined sea salt helps to regulate the levels of water in the body, which helps to maintain the electrolytic balance, as well as helping to balance blood sugar levels. So again, we have been able to debunk a myth and one more time, you can prove the counsel so often and wisely stated. Don't mess with Mother Nature. This is Steve Shank. I hope that this little commentary will help you understand that the products of GoFoods Global are truly the best food on the planet.